To prepare to stencil with a roller, you must first saturate your high density foam roller in wall paint. Next, roll the excess paint off the roller into a paint tray before evening out the spread on a piece of paper towel. Use a second piece of paper towel to remove excess saturation from the roller, testing it out on a finger to see if it smudges. When the paint doesn't smudge, you are ready to stencil. Use repositionable spray adhesive on the back of the stencil to hold it in place and prevent paint bleed. Wait 30 seconds before pressing the stencil flat against the wall. Use a piece of frog tape painter's tape to hold the stencil in place. Place a small piece of frog tape painter's tape beneath each registration mark of the stencil. Use the roller to lightly roll stencil paint through the design using a delicate amount of pressure. As you roll additional layers of paint through the stencil, you will begin to build the color until you reach full coverage. Once satisfied, use a stencil brush to swirl paint through each registration mark onto the frog tape below. Gently peel off the stencil, shift the design over, and line the registration marks up for the next repeat. Press the stencil design in place and add frog tape beneath the registration marks on the opposite side. With the stencil in position, you're ready to begin rolling paint through the design. After each repeat, use a stencil brush to swirl color through the stencil onto the registration marks below. Continue lining up the registration marks, add more tape, and press the stencil details to the surface. Lightly build the paint with the roller and swirl paint through the registration marks. When you finish your repeats, remove the frog tape painter's tape, and then you have perfect patterns for any wall or accent piece.